If you guys are looking for some cheap FIFA 20 coins, head over to u7buy.com. You can buy coins off the website, you can also buy players. So if you wanted Messi, you could buy him off the website. Make sure to use code MUZ at checkout for 5% off. Yes lads, and welcome back to a brand new video. So, I have just spent... Let me go show you. I have just spent 895k. I actually got him for like 35k less. Because the second he came out, I saw Tomori. I was like, yo, I need to get this guy. And usually, sometimes, if you're too early, you can sometimes pay a lot extra and they end up dropping. But I actually got a really good price on him so far. He might drop when this video is out. So we'll see. I don't know whether to keep him or sell him. I will definitely buy him. I don't know whether to sell him and buy him back eventually though. So anyway, boys, a tomorrow review. I'm sure a lot of you guys are interested to know whether or not he's good enough. Do I have to go through his stats? I mean, I will go through him, but you guys don't really need to tell me if he's good or not. Like, come on. I am a Charles fan, if you don't know. If you're new to the channel, if you could drop a like and uh, drop some if you're new. 50 likes would be sick. I do usually review, so if you want me to review anyone else, please do let me know. This guy looks outrageous. The chem style I went with was a Sentinel. He didn't need any more pace, in my opinion. I mean, you could go over an, uh, an anchor and make him, like, the fastest guy on the planet. Uh, he'll keep up with, like, a Dharma and stuff, but... You could also go with a Guardian. I was definitely considering a Guardian. But, I mean, look at his dribbling stats. For a centre-back. For a centre-back, he's going to turn outrageous. 94 agility. Um, I felt like his defensive stats definitely needed upgrading. Because I like mid-range 80s, really. Like, high-rated 80s. So, I thought we'd boost them. And I thought, it's between Guardian and Physicals. Um, Guardian and Sentinels. So, I went with a Sentinels, but you could go with a Guardian. So... There we go, boys. This is the team we're going to be using. We'll use him in a 4-2-3-1. I may try him at CDM. May. Because I don't know if any of you guys are thinking of CDM. He definitely could. Medium, medium, 6 foot 1. 3 star weak foot is a little bit of an issue. But I think centre back. We'll probably just play him centre back. So, anyway, boys. Like I said, if you could drop a like, I'd appreciate that. Let me know who else you'd like me to review. Let's go jump in to game number 1. And see how this 900k centre back works. Okay, boys. Jumping into game number 1. Let's see how he plays. There he is, yellow boots. He's got yellow boots on, boys. Same as David Luiz. Reunited. David Luiz and Tamori at the back. Right, here he is. Let's see how he feels on the ball. <laughs> six foot one, so he can feel his presence. And very slim, though. Very slim. But he's got good strength as well, so I imagine he can still body people. Look at that. King Kenny. King Kenny! Literally just bought him recently. King Kenny is in the team. I spent 1.4 mil on King Kenny and he uh, delivers the goods. 1-0. Right, here's David Luiz. Tamori. He definitely could play CDM. I think his best vision probably is centre-back though because medium-medium. Not sure about medium-medium at CDM. Here's Tamori. Stand him up. Tamori. Yeah, he, he actually doesn't win it. 900k for him. Don't get him. Useless. First tackle, it's just a straight ricochet. Doesn't go into the tackle full half. Went in half-heartedly there. Kenny. Into Trossard. And he does make it 2-0. Love that partnership from Kenny. I was thinking about selling Kenny. I'm not too sure though. This might be a quit. Is this a quit? Yeah, it is a quit. Okay, we'll go jump into another game, boys. We didn't get much of a test of him. Um, very nice on the ball at Agile. But we'll go into another game test him out more. Okay, boys, jumping into game number two. Let's see how he does. Hopefully, we can get some more action with him. Um, obviously, very agile, but I want to see him. He lost his first tackle. So, I want to see more tackles from him. See whether he gets bodied or, or not. Hadji. Hadji. Give me that. Was that a block? Please tell me. That wasn't a block. Oh. Up to Mori. Good head. First head. He wins. Fair play to Mori. To Mori. Sort him out. Good touch. Ref. <laughs> it's a good tackle back, though, from Tamori. That's a blatant foul. I mean, referees in this game are terrible, but Tamori did very well there to to, uh, to get that ball down, that first touch. I mean, you might think I'm overlooking it. Uh, overlooking it? Yeah, overlooking. That's the right word. Um, but maybe in a way, defender with bad ball control may not have controlled that, and then we are 1 0 down. Tamori. Good tackle, Tamori. Again, he doesn't win it. I mean, he wins there. I don't know if this is a 900k card, man. I really don't. I mean, it's so early to say, but... I don't know. It don't feel like a 900k centre-back. Okay, boys, there is the half-time whistle. And Tamori, I mean, he won a few tackles there. But like I was saying, I just don't know if he's worth 900k. I don't know. 
He's not got much presence about him. Apologies. He really hasn't. Um, I should not be losing this game, by the way. I've battered this guy. Giovinco. Finish him. Come on. I'm going to switch this guy, boys. You guys haven't seen because I've not um, I've not shown. I usually skip the replays. This guy's watched everything. And he sat through four full pauses. Literally full 35 seconds. I think he knows me. He's, he's paused it again. I swear you want to get three pauses. He sat through all of them. I think this guy knows me. Because um, he's playing like a dick. He's, he's sat back. And he's just... He keep, I think he's spamming um, parties as well. So, I think he knows me. So, he deserves that. Um, if you're watching this video... <laughs> GG. Um, anyway, Tomori so far. Um, not seen much of him. I t everything... There's been like two, three times where he's literally just gone in half-hearted. And I think that's because of his, his build. Because he's not very built. He just doesn't win the ball very much. So, is he worth 900k? So far, I'd say no. It is only early. But so far, I'd honestly say he's not worth it. But really, I wouldn't. Oh my god, Politano. That was dirty, man. That little bit of verse shield in there. To hold his man off. That's beautiful from Politano. And he does, in fact, quit. Hey, stop inviting me to a party next time, bro. Haha. <laughs> Um, anyway, we'll go into another game, boys, because I want to get one more game in. I want to give him one more test, but pff, not a fan of Tamori, so... Okay, boys, jumping into game number three. I've had a think, and I'm going to put him into CDM, because I think not only, like, even if you guys aren't going to play him CDM, I feel like we'll get a very good gist, because he'll get involved a lot more at CDM. We'll get a very good gist as to whether or not he can actually, like, body people and stuff, because so far, like I said, a couple of tackles, he just hasn't even come out winning, um, which, I mean, for a centre that's 900k... I expect him to win 99% of tackles that go near him. Especially when he's in the, he's, he's the favourite to win it. Win that Tamori. Well played, Tamori. First just in CDM, he's won it. Kenny. Oh, I should have squared it. That's my bad. Kenny. And there it is. Beautiful goal. That was coming. CDM, bro, he gets involved a lot. He's got the passing to play CDM. The agility and balance, like, right there, just before that goal. Had a little bit of pressure, like, tight pressure on him. And turned very nice because of the agility. And, um, yeah, I would recommend maybe, like, a... What chem style? Maybe, probably even a Guardian if you're playing him CDM. Is this guy going to quit? I'm not too sure. He might be changing something. But CDM, he's involved a lot. So, I mean... Maybe I'm being a bit hard on him. Maybe I'm being a bit hard on him. It's just a few tackles he didn't win. Um... And he's not had loads of tackles to go in. So he's probably had about 10 tackles and won. He's won about 7 out of 10. Which is not too bad. But I'm being very harsh on him. Because he's 900k for a centre back. Which is ridiculous. This guy's actually not quit. Nice little goal from Ken. Oh, it's beautiful. Haji. Haji. So lucky. Tomorrow, I'm liking you, bro. At CDM. Right, drill it into Dalglish. Oh, Tomori. That was a poor long pass. I don't know what his long passes are, but maybe that was just a one-off. I'm not too sure, but that was an awful pass from Tamori. Tamori with a win back there. He's won a lot of tackles lately, I can't lie. He has won majority of tackles since being in CDM. Involved a lot more as well. That's why I put him there, because I wanted to see whether or not he'd win a lot of CD uh, CDMs. A lot of tackles. Look how fast he recovers as well. Look how fast he recovers. We'll stick with Tamori, see, see what he does. He's getting tired. Nice ball. Hadji. Beautiful goal. This Hadji shooting is actually sick. Actually sick. So, I mean, I'm up here tomorrow. Um, still, do I think it's 900k? Do I think he's as good as Van Dyke? I'm not sure. Um, 900k is just so much, man. It's, whether or not he'll come down, I'm not too sure. But, I mean, he does bits. He wins the majority of tackles. He feels very nice on the ball. He's fast. So, maybe I'm being a bit harsh. Maybe I'm... I am being a bit harsh, but I don't know. He's still very good. I'm not taking it away from him. I'm just... He's in 900k worth. I'm not sure. He's passing again, man. I don't know if it's just RBA passes that are bad, but that's the second one I've tried. And it's been poor. Wins the ball back again, though, man. I'm just saying, I feel like I've been a little bit harsh on him. He wins a lot of tackles that are near him. And because of how fast he is, he, he can recover so fast if he does miss the tackle. So, maybe I'm being a little bit harsh. That is where... That right there is a big example as to why I'm a bit like... 
I'm not sure. I don't know what his strength is, but he just got bodied by Ben Yedder. Um, I don't know what his strength is, but he's just got bodied again. It's because of his real lean body type. This is what I'm on about. He gets body bullied around a little bit. Tamori. See, that is where he's very good. Because of that pace. Not a lot of players would have got there, but his pace got him there. Well played. Kenny! Makes it three to end off. A nice game. Um, I'll give you my pros and cons on Tamori. Pros, rapid, so he can, even if he misses a tackle, can recover fast. He's tackling on a hole, interceptions, very good. His weakness, I don't know if it's his body type. I'll look at his stats of this game, but his strength is definitely an issue. There's a couple of times over the last few games where he's been bullied about and uh, bodied off the ball. But other than that, very happy with him. He wins most of the tackles. And, uh, yeah, I just don't know if it's worth 900k. 900k is ridiculous. Um, especially when you compare it to, like, a road to the final. Militao. Van Dyke's at like 400k. Um, he might end up dropping loads, and I might end up lo losing loads of coins. And you guys might be like, what the hell is this guy on about? 900k. Uh, but that's what, what I paid for him. King Kenny with two goals, one assist. What did Termori did in terms of tackle? The thing is, with tackles won, he won four out of four. That stat's broken because on other reviews, I've won like 9 out of 9 or something and it only said I won like one tackle. So there we have it, boys. Mr. Tamori is done. Angel 95k. Do I recommend him? No. I don't recommend him. I'm going to be deadly honest. I don't recommend him. Not for this price. I'm not saying he's a bad player at all. He's a very good player. He plays similar to how his stats show. Eight, he's men who have 99 strength. I've always said this in my videos, though. Body type is a huge thing in this FIFA. Because he's got such a lean body type. He can't feel his strength very much. He's not got 99 strength. I'm sorry. I don't think he's worth 900k. I really don't. And it hurts to say as a Chelsea fan. Um, but he's just not worth it. Whether or not he's come down. Has he come down? He is roughly... Oh, he's come down a bit. Yeah, he's come down. Oh, God, he's come down. I'm going to lose coins. Okay, is that 880-ish? Um, so, there we go, boys. If you have got Tamori, let me know your thoughts on him as well. Do you think he's worth 900k? Do you think he's worth that much? Com when you compare him to like a Van Dyke or a Road to the Final Pink Boots? So, anyway, boys. If you could drop a like, 50 likes would be sick. Drop a sub if you're new. And, yeah, boys, I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.